Hey, Arling, tonight's Adam Harris here, your head of communications and storytelling. Another teacher feature. I'm with special education teacher, a good friend of mine, Mary Beth Delaney from South Middle School. Thanks for joining me this morning, Mary. Thanks for having me, Adam. Of course. Um, so we were talking a little bit before this interview started about your workload and how you're engaging your students. I know you have a group of five students in the special education program. What does this look like for you on a weekly and daily basis? Um, it's a lot of Zoom time, as much FaceTime as I can get. Um, the, the contact and the immediate feedback that um, my students require and that I require to make modifications to help them be successful is, is very important. Um, it's actually critical in their process. And uh, having them have time together, having them have social practice time, um, because they all have communication and, and social concerns as well. Um, so that's really important. Plus, it feeds me. It, it feeds my soul. So it, it, it makes it much easier to, to do my day-to-day -day job when I get to see their faces. Oh, my God. Yeah. And I know um, that you are a teenager at heart, Mary Beth. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if I'm a teenager. Maybe a little younger than that. But, yeah. <laughs> but, you know, it's, it's something that the energy you bring to your students, I know you can't be there in person with them, but it's something that you want to bring to them as much as possible throughout the week. So um, I know that you've been, yes, Zooming as much as possible. You know your families pretty intimately. You understand their needs. And um, honestly, you're creating a space for your students and a place to go um, to still be social, still learn the things that they need to learn from you and, and having a space. You know, I have to say that um you hear a lot on the news or, or on Facebook about appreciate your teachers, appreciate your teachers at this time. But I can't tell you enough how much I appreciate the support of the parents that I have, um, the amount of energy and effort that they're making in order for this to be successful, the fact that they plan their day around signing their kids in and out, um, and making sure that they have the necessary materials, that they've supported them, that they reached out. I hope that they feel comfortable enough to contact me when they have a question or a concern or a comment, because I think more than with some other populations, we truly must be a team, especially at this time. 100%. And I know that, did you say Friday's like dance party day for you guys? We have. Have some dance party time. Um, we do our little chair dance, and I do worry sometimes about who might else, who else might be in the room. Um, I'm waiting for the men with the, you know, with the white jackets to knock on my door. But <laughs> we tried to do the stand up and dance, and I was the only one really getting my groove on. So we had to switch to chair dancing. It's okay. gone. It's gone. Yeah. Well. And I'm sure as this goes along, you're going to get some kids to stand up and dance as well. You know, we can only hope because the more, the merrier. So how many, um, how much Zoom time are you doing? How much FaceTime are you doing? And I know, I think you said to me earlier that it's about 45 minutes a day per student. And then there's interaction between right. the Zooms so that the students can get some social interaction. Right, exactly. So, so I have a morning group and an afternoon group. I have a, a group, two, two students that overlap that go from, um, 11 to 1230 and then I have a group of three students from either 130 to, to 230 or from um, One to two and then on Mondays, we're all together with all of our staff um, So there's usually 12 or 13 of us doing lunch bunch on Mondays And I do have to say too that my teaching assistants zoom with me every day. So okay. there's always two teachers um, And they've been incredible during this they help me find websites they respond we do a lot of um respond all emails and daily journals where a student might email us a journal and then all the adults in their lives respond back and it's just an, another nice way to stay connected um, so they they have been amazing well i think that when we get off this call i'm going to give myself a little dance party uh, as well. I'll send you a link and you can sway with us. Sway. Okay, that's okay. that's good. I mean, <laughs> it just feels good to move in that way right now. So thank you very much for everything you're doing. Um, I know your family's totally appreciate it. I love, um, I love the amount of intimacy you have with your families and your students. You understand where they're coming from. Um, and I think that's so much so something that people need right now, the idea of someone there 
to create the space and time that they need to have some normalcy. So that's what you're doing. So thanks. Thank you. They truly are my family. <laughs>